what's up so today I am going to be doing a what's on my phone tag oh oh kill him and I don't have an iPhone I have a Galaxy S4 if you couldn't tell I don't know what I was thinking but I had an iPhone and then my little plan thing was up. I have I go by the two year whatever, so you get a new phone every two years. Well, I was like, everyone's getting the iPhone five. I don't want the iPhone five. I'm gonna get something different. I'm gonna be different. I'm different, yeah, I'm different. I'm different, yeah, I'm different. Just kidding. Get the freaking whatever this little bastard, this little thing, and I'm like, I hate it. I don't hate it. I don't like it though. I miss my iPhone so. But I have one more year with this bad boy. This little bad boy right here. And hopefully by that time, the iPhone 6 is out. And I'll just go to the iPhone 6. You know? So I'm going to show you what's on here. So let's get started. Let's get started right now. Okay, so when you first turn my phone on, it just has the Chanel background. And what time it is. And I don't have a passcode on my thingy. So... I just slide to open it. This is my home screen. It says YouTube on it because I'm basic. And the top has the weather right here. This little blue part, which it's 50 degrees outside. It's so freaking nice. And um, so this first app right here is Keek. If you guys don't know what Keek is, I know a lot of the Kardashians use it. And then some people use it for their social media. Like, um... I can't think of her name right now, but she uses it. I'll link it. It'll be linked right here. But anyways, you just can record 36 second videos, which I have a profile and I'm just under, I'm so C underscore Hill with three O's in the so. So I will have that linked below if you guys want to see more of my face. <laughs> But anyways, then I have Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, you really should. Twitter and Tumblr. And those are the four apps that I use the most. So those are the ones that I have on my home screen. And then at the bottom, it's kind of like the iPhone. It had four of the things, like with the messenger, the phone, internet, and just my apps. But I just took those out and just put the internet, the phone, and the apps. Then I scroll to the left, and I have this little little I don't know what you'd call it a little widget I guess because I could take it out if I want to like I just hold it and I can move it anywhere I can delete it I can put it anywhere but it's just right there and it has my messages so that I can automatically see them sorry so I can automatically see them I can just scroll through them and see who I've messaged lately and you know whatever then I have more of my most used apps which are my gallery for my photos my camera YouTube and of course do it for the vine duh then I scroll over to the left again and these this is really convenient for like my YouTube videos my subscriptions these are the most uploaded videos like the most recent uploaded videos that pop up right here so I know when someone has uploaded a new video I can just scroll through them and see and then I have all my extra apps over here which I have um, pick stitch, which is like just a picture collage if I want to do something for Instagram or whatever. Um, iHeartRadio, which you guys should really get. It's so good. I don't, you can't do playlists on here, but it's kind of like Pandora, but I got kind of sick of Pandora and it was kind of old, and so I got iHeartRadio. And you just have like your artists, like mine, my favorites are Justin Timberlake, Ariana Grande, Beyonce, Britney Spears, Pussycat Dolls, Demi Lovato bangers um drake and 303 so those are the most listened to stations that i have on there and then i have snapchat pinterest Wanello. if you guys don't know what Wanello is Wanilo, Wanello. i don't know how to pronounce it really you can pronounce it anyway it stands for want need wait yeah want need love and what it is really is you find things that you like on here. Here, let me go a little closer for you. If you find something that you really like, like say, oh my gosh, look at that glow-in-the-dark charger. I click on it, and it's only $7, and it takes me to the website. You can either save it for later, and you can save it on the Epic Wish, wish List right here. 
things I want as a gift, epic wish list, or something you can give as a gift and you just mark it for whatever. Or you can go back and you can buy it now and that's where you get it. That's where, that's the website it would take you to is Amazon. So that's really cool. And then I have Play Store, which is just like iTunes, but for Samsung's, it's called Play Store, I guess. Facebook, which I don't really get on. I just get on because it's like filled with drama and all my high school friends. That's what I get on for that. My calculator. And then I have a little widget for my messages, which I don't use. And my calendar. And then we're back to the home screen and scrolling to the right. I have just like extra little widgets that I download. I have like some things that I edit with for my Instagram. Kick, which is really convenient. Sometimes people are like, Kick, oh, that's sketchy. Like, that. that's a sketchy app. You could use this. This is really convenient. Like, when you're making YouTube friends, you don't want to always get on YouTube or get on your email to check your messages from like a YouTube friend or an internet friend but you don't you don't know I'm good enough to give you give them your phone number so you can just get a kick and tell them your username and it can be on your phone and you can just message them from your phone just like text messaging so this is just a good thing where you're not giving them your phone number because you don't know them too well yet you don't have to get on the computer and message them through email or through the YouTube messaging system or whatever so I have my email on here, Gmail, Netflix for when I go and work out. I like to watch Netflix when I'm biking or walking on the treadmill. Flipgram, which is so cool. I love this app. If you don't have it or you don't know, like you see people who um, have, what would you call it? Oh my gosh, I can't even think. Flipgram is like a picture slideshow for Instagram that you can use. If you've ever saw anyone with those picture slidegram slideshows on there, but you don't know what kind of app they're using, I use Flipgram. And I'll just show you, like, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll show you. I made one for my friend for her birthday, and this was it. Okay, so that's basically it. Her favorite rapper is Tupac, so I just put that song to it, and it gives you, like, little songs. You can either buy the song and then, like, pick the section that you want, the, um, to pick the section of the song that you want for the slideshow, or it'll just give you a free download of the section that they picked. So I really love that. And then I have Care.com because that's what I do for a part-time job is I babysit, and it's really convenient, like, if someone, like, in inboxes me I don't have to get on my computer and look at it I can just look right there and that's it oh my goodness okay so that is everything that is on my galaxy s4 or 4s I never know I always get that backwards but anyways give this a thumbs up if you guys like these kind of videos and want me to do something similar I don't even know what I would do something that's like what's on my iPod if you want I don't know or what kind of music I like to listen to whatever what kind of playlists I have give it a thumbs up and also give it a thumbs up if any of the apps on my phone or on your phone but until then bye bye